we're going to use the nuclear decay equations to show how to scale the magnitude and time constants of differential equations that will be implemented in op amps. For example, we will have a thousand kilograms of radioactive material and the half-life will be one year. So if we were to put this straight into a differential equation and then convert it to op amps, NO would be a thousand. For a thousand kilograms, we convert that to a thousand volts. Then for the time constant of for the half-life of one year, we have log two kilogram per year, or log two over more than three million seconds. This means that our circuit has to be able to handle a thousand volts and run for many years to actually simulate this. And this would be a real-time simulation. In order to implement this in op-amp circuits, we got to have to scale NO to our voltage range. This is easily done by having one volt equal to 100 kilograms. To scale the time constants, I would want one millisecond to equal the half-life. Therefore, I can have a log two divided by a millisecond or 693 for lambda. Then I can set my RC constants to 693, choose the capacitor first, solve for the resistance. In this case, we've scaled the voltage and the time independently. This is the circuit that we would use, take the differential equation, put it into integral form. We have our NO, NRC, I, and RI, and that's the amount of nuclear material left. And we can see how we can, it was, we were able to scale so easily. The exponential, in this case, goes from zero to one. And if we want it to simulate faster, we just increase this time constant. This, will, this value here limits the actual, how far the circuit will go up to. So if this is one, and that's the max of that is one, the output is one. That's 100, and the max output of this is one, this is 100. That's why NO was selected to be 10 volts. And here would be the final circuit, R1.44K, the capacitor of the integrator, one microfarad, 10 volt initial condition. And there you have simple scaling of time and magnitude of differential equations implemented with op amps.